Hi everybody, my name is Whitney and welcome back to my channel. So sorry I've been a little MIA lately. Um, I've moved into my apartment for my junior year of college. I know it's a little bit different than my usual setup, so if you do want an apartment tour, let me know um, in the comments below, or a room tour, or whatever. Um, it's not fully complete yet, it takes a really long time to actually make a new place feel homey, so I'll let you know when I can do it, but if you definitely want one, let me know. So today the video is going to be a what's in my bag slash what's in my wallet. Um, I've been loving my bag lately, it is the Louis Vuitton Neverfull. Sorry, it's so big I can't even get it into frame. Um, and I have this giant like puff on it. My most viewed video so far and a lot of people like it, a lot of people don't. But um, I know a lot of people have been wanting an update video on it. So I figured I'd film one. So the first thing I want to mention is in the unboxing video that I did, I was like, oh, I'm never going to have it cinched in, like, ever. Yeah, I, like, never uncinch it unless, like, I really need to fit stuff in here. Um, I start school Monday, so I'll probably uncinch it because I'm going to have my laptop and everything in there. So I normally keep it clasped uh, just because, so it doesn't, like, unfold and everything. So first on the outside, I just have this little, like, Ball. I don't even know where I got this. I can't even remember, but it's really soft and it's just like fuzzy like this. So the first thing I'm going to pull out is, people are probably going to be like, what the hell? But it is, <laughs> it is my little elephant pencil case. Um, I just have pens and pencils in here. I like having a pencil case for any bag, not particularly this one, but um, just because, you know, you never know if it, your pen can like explode and stuff. I mean, it would ruin the lining of any bag. So I keep like a bunch of pens and pencils in here. So next, I have my makeup bag. This is a Vera Bradley print one. Normally, if I'm going out or whatever, I'll throw in like my powder and stuff, but I haven't kept it in here. So I just have this little like mirror that it pretty much broke <laughs> um this hand sanitizer this was an old bath and body works one they have new prints now it's um island margarita sorry if i keep looking in the viewfinder i want to make sure that what happened last time isn't happening again with the footage um where it kind of went like in and out um and then it's this little squid guy and it lights up so next i have a carmex cherry chapstick I have the Corez lip butter that I showed in my favorites video. I just have like a Claire's little like makeup brush. Eyebrow pencil which is the NYX Micro Brow in Ash Brown. Um, I have two nail files, just like that. I have two NYX lip butters, one, er, they're butter glosses, sorry. Um, one is in creme brulee and one is in eclair. And I have two mini like ibuprofen tablet packets. I have an Aquaphor lip balm, a Chapstick Total Hydration in Sweet Peach, and a MAC lipstick in Caddy. So it looks like this. And then here's the color. Sorry the lighting's kind of bad too, but I'll get everything perfected once I really move in and understand like when's the best time to film and everything. I actually have been going through with Spirit Week for my sorority because recruitment is next week. Oh, if you guys ever want me to film a video talking about like my sorority and recruitment and any other questions, um, I know I have some viewers that are probably around my age group or younger that are going into college and you were wanting to rush you should definitely go Greek um, I can always make a video on it so the next thing I have is just a Burt's Bees chapstick and it's the nourishing one so it's mango and the next thing I have is soap and glory hand food in sugar crush so it's just like um, a hand lotion but it literally smells like margaritas and it is my favorite as you can tell my hand sanitizer is margarita scented too so the final things I have in here are a like blue little clip, um, a nail clipper, because I have been growing my nails out, as I said in like, I think it was my favorites video because I mentioned my biotin. And then um, I have the Clump Crusher by CoverGirl Mascara. And that's it in here. 
God, I haven't gone through this in forever, so. Okay, so this is from American Eagle. It's just, it has some watermelons on it and it's a sunglass case. And these are the sunglasses that I showed in my American Eagle haul. Next, I have a pack of Trident gum, the original flavor. This one's literally my favorite one because it's not too minty because it's like more sweet. And I have a whole thing of Tums. I tend to have, sorry TMI, but I tend to have really bad like heartburn and stuff. Um, and I think it just like runs in my family, I don't know. So, plus it's nice to have if anybody else needs it too. It's just the sorted fruit one. Then I have crazy amount of headbands. Oh, I forgot to mention, speaking of headbands, I got my hair fixed. Um, you can't really tell right now, but it's more ombre. Um, I will be posting a picture on Instagram with my new hair, so I left the links below for all my social media if you want to follow me on it. Um, but next video I'll have my hair down so that you can see kind of how it looks, and I can always do a video on that too. Okay, so I have a bunch of headbands. So I have American Eagle, and it has just pineapples on it. Then this one's just from like Target, I think. It's like a goodie one. Then this one's a goodie one too. I have a lot of headbands because my hair is short and I was trying to cover that gross orange band that was through my hair. My hair does look orange in this lighting, but I swear it's not. I have just a mint one. Um, I remember I got this one from Claire's, I think, like forever ago. And then this one's from American Eagle too, and I never understand. It's like huge, and it's always really confusing, but it's like, it's like two layers and it's like knotted. I also have a hard headband in here too, for like more fancy, I guess. Um, and it's just like che cheetah animal, I don't know. So then I have tampons. <laughs> Um, some mints. These are the Mentos Now Mints. They're really strong, but they're really good. They work really well. I have, I have another pack of the Trident Original Flavor Gum. I also have a Tangle Teaser. Um, I have Beats Headphones. The only thing I hate about this, the little earbud ones, the only thing I hate about this case is everything clings to it, but I just keep them in there. Then I actually got this thing from Francesca's and I thought it was like genius idea. I mean, it's not like the prettiest looking thing. And one side is a USB and one side is like for like iPhone. So I thought it'd be good if I didn't have my phone charger or something. I can plug this end into my computer and then just plug my phone into it. So you don't have this long cord and you can like charge it in class or whatever. Then I have, this is one of their new um, scents. It's pink, cool, and bright. This one. It smells really good. Then I have a bag of just like mints. So in this little Kate Spade bag, um, I actually have my nameplate from American Eagle because I'm hoping to transfer to the one here, but um, I just threw it in here, but it was just my Jean Expert tag. <laughs> I don't know. Then I have my bottle of Biotin that I mentioned in my favorite. So the bag is almost empty. I have this that I have to go through and then this little pocket in here. And then that's it. So in this little pocket, I keep all of the cards that you don't wanna normally keep in your wallet but you wanna have on hand and all of my receipts or anything like paper that I need to keep. So I have, I'm going through these cards quickly. I have a Charming Charlie's gift card, my Panera card, my Sam's Club card, a Target gift card, um, I don't know. Some of these are just like business cards. Um, famous Footwear Rewards, Ulta, Saks Office, Dunkin' Donuts gift card, American Eagle Rewards card, a spa gift card that I've had for literally ever because I don't know where like this will be taken. Like I just don't know. Um, some money on this like food card. Um, an Anthony's Coal Fire Pizza, ten dollars off your next meal card. Um, Continental Airlines. It's not even called Continental Airlines anymore. It's called United, but this is like my flying pass. Um, my old driver's license. Um, my nail place that I go to, another business card, and my old PBA card. So that's my little stack of cards. And then some receipts and stuff that I have. Um, this is like the Kohl's like rewards card. I don't know why they can't give us a small card. They give you that giant thing. So I keep that in there. Then I have um, my receipt from Sam's. It's just like a Sam's receipt. Um, 
What else? I have TJ Maxx because I literally live there. Another TJ Maxx gift card receipt. Bed Bath & Beyond. Sorry, I know this is really boring, but I'm just reading them. Um, Walmart. My dry cleaning. I have my receipt for that that I have to pick up Friday. And then my uh, movie ticket for Lights Out. Which was pretty good. Um, uh, my favorite genre of movies is horror. So it was pretty decent. It wasn't bad, but it could have been better, I feel like. So, oh, I have a thing about keeping movie tickets, too. Just, I love keeping them. I don't know what it is, but whenever I see a movie, I always keep the ticket. So in this final little pouch that we have here, I have a few things that I like to keep in here easy access to and that I can zip up so no one can like stick their hand and grab it. So I have, these are my new sunglasses. I got them from TJ Maxx. They're very reflective so you can probably see everything but I really like them. And then I have my key holder. So here she is. I have a key hanging out. Sorry. But um, so I have three keys in here. Um, this is my house key for when I'm home in Florida. Um, my car key. Uh, for you wondering, I have a Volkswagen Jetta. Um, so I have like the cool little key. I don't know. And then this is my apartment key. It's actually really cool. People are like, what? But you put it in and it like, it's like all like electronic. So it reads it. Um, cause everybody, you think you can use your key in everybody's house. Obviously you can't. Um, and it also opens the gate because I live, my apartment's gated. So it's pretty cool. Then I have this set of keys. My dad actually bought me this thing. It's a thing of mace, but it's really small. And I'm happy that it's kind of small because the other ones are in those big containers. But you literally lift the lid and press it. And then I have like my room key because I share with a roommate who's actually my best friend. She just hasn't moved in yet. And then this is my um, mailbox key. The final thing in here, I'm going to put the bag down so empty <laughs> um is my wallet and this is kind of like a wallet update so i took my license out of here because it says my license number first at the top but when you open it up so i normally keep my license here that's my pba card right now then i have this card this card and then this is my credit card and then in here i or normally in this pouch i keep um cash and then in this like middle section um, I keep, sorry, I keep my little Tiffany, my boyfriend got me this Tiffany necklace for my birthday, so I keep this little pouch just in here if I ever need to take it off and it won't get lost in my bag. Um, and then I normally keep my birth control <laughs> in this pouch too. And then this pouch behind the zipper, this one, um, I keep my ECU, um, like student ID, um, Sephora Insider, my insurance card, and my American Eagle, like, credit card. I don't even know why I covered it. There was nothing on it. <laughs> um, thing I did want to mention, though, about the bag, for some reason, um, because, I mean, while I was living in Florida, I mean, it rains every day in the summer for at least an hour, is if the leather on the straps got wet, it would leave i don't know if you're gonna get that on camera yeah like right here see like a water dripped there i said oh water a water droplet dripped there um some here too like you can kind of see um and then a couple drops on like the actual like rim but i don't know if any of you have like a Louis Vuitton bag or anything let me know if that's happened with you too it's not that big of a deal for me honestly like I would never be like I need a new bag because of this I mean it's a bag it's gonna wear and tear but um yeah just let me know because I don't know if it's just like the coating on there or whatever yeah that's it um sorry I know it wasn't the perf most perfect what's in my bag video and it was really quick with what's in my wallet but I really don't keep a lot in there <laughs> The lighting will get better, I promise. Um, a lot of things will go on my wall, switch up where I film. Um, I'm excited to continue filming throughout the school year. Definitely leave me ideas, though. It's really hard, um, 
you know, with everything going on, I want to give you guys videos that you want to see. I can do more makeup ones, but they always seem to be the ones that not everybody watches. If you have any other ideas or comments or anything, please comment them down below. Please like the video if you enjoyed it. It really helps me understand like what videos people like and what they don't. Um, and I will talk to you next time. Thanks guys.